Hi. I wonder, do you ever think back over your life and remember a day or a defining moment perhaps where somehow everything changed and nothing was ever the same again? For me, the experience of becoming a Christian had several moments just like that. A couple of weeks ago I shared a thought that I had as a young man in my early 20s, a sudden realisation that my life had no foundation whatsoever. That thought hit me out of nowhere around 3am one morning late in 1990 as I was driving through the night. And I felt at the time like my heart was literally sinking into a black hole with no hope. Looking back, I think I was being shown in that moment that I was just like the foolish man that Jesus spoke about in Matthew chapter 7, who built his house on sand. And that was me, building my life on nothing of any real substance. It was a defining moment in my life, and it started me on a journey towards a new life of faith in Jesus Christ. Well, fast forward several months to a cold, snowy night in Nottingham in February 1991. I'm sitting in a pub, having a pint with a guy that I've never met before, and we're talking about the gospel, the good news about Jesus Christ. And there's a point in our conversation where he quotes to me the words of Jesus that we find in John chapter 5 and verse 24. I tell you the truth, says Jesus. Whoever hears my word and believes him who sent me, has eternal life and will not be condemned. They have crossed over from death to life. I'd never heard those words before, even though I was familiar with church in a formal sense. But as they were spoken to me in that moment, it was like a light came on in my mind. Mists cleared, the person of Jesus Christ came into focus and I understood for the first time why he had to come and live and die on the cross and rise again, and that he was the eternal rock that my life had to be built on. I tell you the truth, says Jesus, because he is the truth and he cannot lie. These words of truth are for whoever hears and believes. He puts no barriers in our way. He doesn't discriminate. He doesn't wait for us to get our lives sorted out. His offer is open to all who will hear his word and believe. And in that pub, I was hearing and I was understanding. But I knew that there had to be a response, a step of faith, a turning away from myself and a turning to God. And for me, that step of faith would come the following day. But I'll tell you about that next time. But I knew in that moment that Jesus' promise of eternal life and no condemnation, a passing from death to life, was what I had to have. Here is the gift of God's grace in all its simplicity and wonder. Nothing in this world can come close. This is God's gift to give and his alone. And looking back, the course of my entire life changed as I heard these words spoken to me. They're stamped on my mind and on my heart to the day that I die. They're going to be on my lips when I pass from this life. And I will still be speaking them when I wake and meet my Lord face to face. God bless.